Hello folks. This is Transit Joe here. And uh 78 degrees. Rain cooled 78. We just had a big thunderstorm roll through with a lot of lightning, heavy rain. You can see the streets. We're right here in the border of uh, Ghouls and Princeton in um, southern Miami-Dade County. We go, we're going to go for a ride right here in the Ghouls, uh, Culver Bay area. We're not going to cover any particular area. Just going to go for a nice sweet ride. Uh, bored at home, so been feeling kind of depressed. I lost uh, my cat. Been with me for 17 years. Lost a close friend from work. A close personal friend too. Um, due to breast cancer. That hurt. Still hurting from that. It's just been bad news uh, this week all around. So it's time to uh, just go for a ride and uh, see something new, show you all something uh, different. Sections of Miami that nobody else uh, shows, shows you. So. We're going to be taking a you know, ride down these roads and uh, Check them out. We're on Old Cutler Road, by the way. And there's a C1 canal we're going over across right now. The C1 canal is a very good, very good fishing spot for uh, largemouth bass and uh, peacock bass. So this area we're in is really a, kind of a low elevation area. We got apartment rentals to the right and we have houses, single family houses to the left. It's called Catalina West. It's part of the lakes by the bay region of uh, Old Cutler, of uh, Cutler Bay. So let's take a ride in here in this neighborhood. It's kind of a little different. I kind of like the architecture. The reputation to having a real strict HOA. family and two-story houses. Most of them were built in the late 80s, early 90s. Some of them are still in the old cold, which means uh, you don't have to do a... If you have a two-story home, the second story doesn't have to be CBS construction. CBS meaning concrete, block, and stucco which is stronger. Some of these have uh, still have wood frame for the second floors. And some of them are one and a half story. Which means they have a garage on the bottom and then the, you go up some stairs and you have the, like, a, like a second story there. That's where your entrance is and your bedrooms and all that. And uh, and you go straight to the patio because there's a 
a little bit of an incline as you can see right there in these properties especially this blue house right here now we're in the, the Montego Bay community see you see how uh, See, like that'll be the patio on this house right here on the right and you can see it on this one too it's like the, the front is one story and the back of the house is a uh, second story like and you can see it on that one too like the garage goes in and that's the first story is on the garage and the second is uh now what the hell we got here got a little what's the little scion and it says death and skulls and somebody's fascinated with skulls and rest in peace and a casket and oh my gosh Got a community pool that faces the lake. This is a low laying area. That's why some of the houses sit up quite a bit. I would not like to be the one to mow that lawn, man. Jeez. But it's very nice and very unique. I wanted to uh, show it to y'all. Lots of trees, a lot of nice tree canopy. I like that. Right, you're gonna see the tennis courts. And we came into a uh, Montego Bay here using the the back entrance through uh, what was it Catalina West. This is their main entrance right here. Nice tree line road. Drive, which is uh, 216th Street. So we're going to take a little ride here on 216th Street and we'll call it. And uh, we'll shoot another video. Go for another little ride. I don't want to make it too long. Yeah, man, it sucks. Uh, that is the fifth close friend that I've lost to breast cancer. All people that I admired and respected a lot. Yeah, I've been, you know, I needed to get out of the house and kind of, you know, down in the dumps. I made a video in a couple days or a few days. This community to the right is, made, is by Lenar and like most Lenar communities. The Isles of Bayshore, it's gated. Oh, there. Now, I'll tell you what. 
gonna make this ride just a little bit longer. This wasn't planned or anything at all. It's just, just riding. Riding and looking. We're on the eastern fringes of the, the county here. The, the bay is less than, less than a mile away to the east. Bay Shore is another entrance. Place is huge. Lots of foliage, very nice. Windy Point to the left. Now we're on Galloway Road, 87th Avenue, headed south. Pretty nice uh, walking or bike trail to the right. I broke my bike many, many times through here before I broke my back and now I can't. I've been told not to get on a bike again unless it's a trike or a tricycle. I don't know how I feel about that. One day I will, maybe I won't, I don't know. Jury's, jury's out on that. But I sure used to like to ride my bike. This place here has a lot of invasive species. And you, have, you see a lot of iguanas, a lot of tegus. I've encountered snakes out here. Alligators, crocodiles, no big deal. They're all afraid of you. Nobody wants to mess with you. They're all, they all go the other way. Big old gators, you approach them, they're on the bank, selling themselves, you know, they see that bike coming down the trail, they're done, they're gone. The snakes, really have to train your eyes to see them because they, they do two things. Either they stay still, wait for you to go away, or they'll make a mad, mad dash away from you. And, uh, oh, look, a kitty cat, a feral cat. Yeah, my cat, it's two sisters, that I picked up. They were born the day before Thanksgiving in 2005. And they've been with me since their house cats. They're in the house all the time. She had a very good life. Now, this is it's depressing to see the way her sister's just looking for her. She's not eating. She's not sleeping. She's just looking for her sister and can't find it. She passed away on Sunday of um, natural causes. We're now in uh, Black Point Park in Marina. Nice place to hang out at, ride the bike and all that. Mosquitoes.
people come out here to set their kayaks. Like I said, we're right along the fringes of the, bit of the Biscayne Bay right now. came where I lost uh, another close friend lost her to lupus hit me real hard I came out here I spent hours in this park just trying to gather my thoughts Just gonna park for a little bit here and relax and uh hope you enjoy the video the ride to nowhere <laughs> from uh black point and miami-dade county where it's 78 degrees wet and humid This is uh, Transit Joe. Remember, be out on the street, stay sober, drive safe. You need all your skills to stay safe. So, I've seen a lot of dead bodies in my career from drunk driving. So, please stay safe. You know what it means. Bye-bye.